Yes, you can play Arena Breakout with your PlayStation 4 or any other controller on your Android smartphone. In this video, I'm going to show you how and which app you need. It's very easy. Just follow, subscribe to the channel and let's get into it. Okay, so now the first thing we need to do is go to our Play Store and write down Mantis Gamepad Pro and download the application. It is a free application, you can download it in the Play Store or on Google, just write down Mantis Gamepad Pro APK. Okay, once you have downloaded the app, you go and open it. Okay, now that I have opened the app, you see that we need to activate the application and that one gamepad is connected. You just connect it via Bluetooth, uh, the standard way you connect the PS4 or Xbox controller or PlayStation 5 and it will recognize it automatically. Now let's activate the application. Now, once you open it, you will see that there's a list of things you need to activate. These things you need to activate in your developers uh, options. In my case, everything which is activated is already checkmarked. I just need to activate developers options. You need to activate enable floating widgets, very important. Enable USB debugging, allow overlays over settings and turn on the display permission monitoring. Okay, now let's enable wireless debugging together. You see it brings you automatically there. Here we are at wireless debugging. We turn it on, okay, and now we go back. Now we need to pair the application with our phone. It will pop up a screen like this, just put it a little bit up, and now scroll back down to wireless debugging and press on the blue here, and then you will see pair device with pairing code. You have to press on that, and now you see a six digit number. This number we have to put up here, 952990, okay, we press pair, and now we see wireless debugging is connected, and Mantis body is connected and check marked, okay, now we can go back, and when we go back you will see the screen, you go back, and now you see it's check marked and it's activated. Now, when you want to play your game, you need to add it here. Here you have the add button. I have added already a couple games. When you press the add button, you can see uh, all your different games here and you can add them. So you can start the game from in the Mantis Pro application. And now we will start Arena Breakout. Launch game. The game is launched. And as you can see, uh, I'm playing now with my controller. The game launched fast because I had already opened it before, so you don't wait. See, I can jump, I can lay down, lay on the ground, I can aim, and I can shoot. Now, you can map your buttons of your controller the way you like. You need to press the Mantis uh, on the Mantis icon. And the first time you start it, it won't be mapped yet, so you need immediately to press this button. And here, you can choose your L stick, your right stick, and then you can move it around. For example, I'm going to show you how I add a button. Here is key, I'm going to add a key. In this case, the share button. I press on it, and now the share button is here. You see? And then I can put it wherever I want on the screen. And if I press now share, it's like... I touched it at that place and I mapped all my buttons here, my R2 to shoot for example, L2 to aim, you see, and my L stick I put it here and now like this I can move and I can play. And if it's not going fast enough for you, when you press here and you have your right stick, you have a settings icon and here you can change your sensitivity. I'll put it way up now just to show you. And now, as you see, it's way faster. You see? So that's something you can do. And in this game, it's actually very nice to play with a controller. It's uh, better to play like PUBG. Uh, Arena Breakout uh, works better with the controls and you have better aims. Yeah? I hope you like this tutorial. I make more, more different videos about... Uh, I make multiple videos like this. 
uh, on topics on how to play uh, games which do not support controllers with a controller. If you like this kind of stuff, feel free to subscribe. If you have questions, write them down below and see you in the next video.